Let's play a little game of, well, that sounds sus. Now, imagine going to court, fully expecting to have things go your way. And instead of things going your way, the judge asks for a continuance. Okay, you go, you agree that you have to do the continuance, and then less than 12 hours after that, you get a notification that says, hey, someone has made another Facebook account with your exact name and credentials. Seems a little sus to me, but what do I know? What, what, what sense does that make? I mean, come on now, people. Why, why make fake Facebook accounts and do all this? Because I can tell you what can happen. Is anybody, anywhere can make a Facebook account with your name, all your personal information, and they can say and do whatever they want, and you're kind of screwed. Like, if, oh, well, you're not supposed to go to this place, and then somebody makes the account, and picture, picture, picture of said place. Well, if it's online, it has to be true, right? That They have proof. Oh, well, you were there. No, I wasn't. I don't know. This has your name, your picture, your information. Is this your birthday? Is this your phone number? All of it? Yeah. Yeah, it is. So, clearly, it has to be you. No. No. Anybody can do that anymore. See, I was fortunate in that one of my good friends actually was alerted to it and asked me about it. I knew nothing about it. They reported it. And now it has been taken care of, but God only knows how long that was active, what was done. So I did the smartest thing I could think of is I tried to get ahead of it. Um, I notified my attorney about it. So... If anything happens, it's kind of weird. Like, if you're going to do something, probably doesn't make sense to do it so close to when something happens. Like, timing is, timing is bad for that. But, I guess we'll see. We'll see what happens, because that's, that's dirty pool. That's dirty, dirty pool right there. Oh, well. Well, we'll see what happens. We'll go from there. Bye.